I'm here at the Guggenheim Museum in New York City. This museum houses a collection that spans from contemporary to impressionist works. But there's one piece that's made an impression on me. Welcome to Golden Thrones. This fully functional 18 karat gold toilet is an art installation here at the Guggenheim called America, and it's open to the public. The piece is by artist Maurizio Catalan, who actually came out of retirement to give this gift to the world. I didn't have a favorite artist before, but boy do I now. Trust me, you're gonna wanna smuggle in a selfie stick for this one. The artist has stated that this is 1% art for the 99%. You know the 99% at the Guggenheim. People wait in line for over an hour to use this toilet, so you might want to hit the restroom ahead of time. This piece, like all great art, asks big questions. Now let's go to someone who has the answers. I'm here with Mike Zoll, Associate Director of Facilities here at the Guggenheim. Mike, thanks for being here with us. Welcome. What is the maintenance process? How is it different than your classic porcelain Kohler? Our, our cleaning company, Crawford, goes in there um, about every 15 to 20 minutes, mm -hmm. and they give this thing a, a, a rub down, if you will. Over. Yeah, yeah, it's cleaned with like medical alcohol wipes. Have you ever had to do emergency maintenance on the toilet? Uh, yes, I've been granted permission to, uh, if need be, go in, check it out, and if, if it can be plunged, then call for the plunger and, and go at it. Do you use a special plunger uh, for not that? Not a gold plunger, it's just a, uh, no. just a rubber. Rubber is better, yeah. So I assume you have used the toilet? I have not. You have not? I have not. <laughs> well, I was in there the other day, and actually I was ready to walk out. Uh -huh. And I stopped, and I kind of looked down at it. And I said, nah, and I just, I just took off. I think the public, uh, they do enough with it. So there you have it, an actual golden throne here at the Guggenheim. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got some art to interpret.